Geo Makes His Stand, written by Daniel Wells, and adapted into audio by me, Geo the Avatar Creature. Hey folks, the name's Geo, Geo the Avatar Creature. You may remember me from my own channel on YouTube, spending time on Sodor with Thomas the Tank Engine and his friends, and also spending time with Sonic the Hedgehog and his friends. Like Sonic, I too have powers a bit like him. Also like Sonic, I use them to fight bad guys and protect the innocent. But this story isn't how I live. This is about the time I managed to defeat Sonic's enemy, Dr. Ivo Robotnik. Or should I say, Dr. Eggman. <laughs> I remember that day very well. It was a lovely evening on Sodor, but then Robotnik attacked and had his robots attacking innocent people. Unfortunately, Sonic, Tails, Knuckles and I were there at the time and began fighting the bad Nicks and helping the people get to safety. When we had a bit of time, we could try and get the people to somewhere they could take shelter. Sonic! How's the evacuation doing? Slow! But it's going well. Guys, behind you! We look to see Robotnik there smirking at us. Eggman, you again? That's right. Ha <laughs> You never give up, do you, Robotnik? I will never rest until the world is... Yeah, yeah, we get it. You'll never give up until the world is under your control, but you have to deal with us first. <laughs> so just say you're going to destroy us and stop embarrassing yourself. Robotnik was now furious. Curse you, Geo the Avatar creature! Like Sonic, not only you ruin my plans, but you ruin my speeches as well! Does it look like I care, you big loser? No matter. Prepare to be destroyed! Robotnik then prepared his transport to attack us. Sonic, you Tails and Knuckles get everyone to safety. I'll distract Eggman. Go get him, Geo! Ha! You are no match for me, Geo! Okay, Eggman. You wanna go fast? Let's go fast! I shot off and that crazy maniac began shooting at me as he chased after me. I could run as fast as Sonic, but I was surprised to see Eggman was chasing me at the same speed. He must have another one of Sonic's quills or something. Hang on. Wait a minute. I noticed that some red energy was coming from Robotnik's vehicle. He's using my own energy against me. Well, what a nerve! Eggman chased me through the whole town of Knapford. By the time nightfall had come, I was still going and dodging Eggman's blasts until... Ah! Robotnik finally got me. I fell down onto the ground unconscious. Sonic, Tails and Knuckles saw the whole attack. Geo! The three friends of mine were destruct, thinking I had been defeated, but Robotnik was overjoyed. Ho 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 ho, yes! I finally got him! Ho 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 ho! Eggman, you monster! How could you do this? Because I am a man who deserves conquest on this planet! That black thing was just a silly little bat creature, whatever it is. He doesn't belong here. Sonic turned to face his nemesis, his face filled with anger. You're wrong, Eggman. That bat creature knew more about being human than you will ever be. Agreed. His name is Geo. This is his home. And he's our friend. At the very moment Sonic said that, my eyes jolted open and my body began sparking with red lightning.
everyone looked to see me slowly starting to stand up. Once I was up, my eyes opened. Sonic, Tails and Knuckles smiled at this. Sonic then looked at Robotnik quickly before turning back to me. He's all yours, Geo. They moved out of the way as I glared at Robotnik. Dr. Ivo Robotnik, you have something that's mine. I clenched my fist, draining the sample of my power from Eggman's machine. This is my power, and I'm not using it to run away anymore. I'm using it to protect my friends. I watched as Eggman put his goggles on. Growled at me, annoyed that I was still alive. You have interfered with me for the last time, kill the Avatar creature! Bring it on, old man. As Robotnik prepared targeting his rocket at me, I slowly knelt down. Robotnik began smirking as he got ready to shoot at me. Here we go! As he fired at me, I shot off, dodging and destroying his shots. And then I began attacking and hitting his vehicle, like how Sonic would do on his video games in the past. I was one at the time at first, but then it began to go faster, like I was in more than one spot at the same time. I then slid back along the road, smirking at Robotnik's now damaged flight. Gah! Now I am so angry! Guess what, Eggman? You've got a date. Justice! Blue Blur? Sonic nodded before running behind Eggman. He then threw a ring out, opening a portal to a prison behind the crazy madman. I smirked as he charged at me, but I charged at him too. I then curled into an energized ball, hitting Robotnik's flyer, breaking it completely before it sent him flying through the portal and in prison. I will have my revenge! After the portal closed, I stopped glowing and the people of the town gave me a huge round of applause. Sonic walked up to me. Great job, Geo! I knew you'd got this! Hey, Sonic. We got this. I raised my hand for a high five, and a proud Sonic jumped up and slapped my hand. <laughs> you did pretty good, Avatar Bat. <laughs> Thanks, Blue Blur. You were great, Geo! Not bad for a creature like you. And you managed to get that crazy maniac in prison. Do you think Eggman will stay in jail this time? I'd like to believe that, Tails, but somehow I doubt that very much. I was right. Eggman would likely escape to fight us another day, but even if he does escape from prison, me, Sonic and his friends will be ready. Robotnik? This isn't over.